How are you guys? My name is Bryce. This is Shield of Respect. Uh, we are playing FTL. Uh, the TAC-2 is the ship we are currently flying. We are about to head to the Zoltan Homeworlds. We are extremely low uh, on um, health, I guess. Hull integrity. Um, if you go ahead and look at the length of this video, it'll tell you whether or not I die. Probably pretty short episode. So, Zoltan Homeworlds headed there. Hoping we can maybe grab that Zoltan, that sweet, sweet Zoltan ship. Uh, you are far from Federation home space here in Zoltan territory. And it's not clear whether the authorities will have any goodwill remaining. Still, you have to push forward. I would like to find a shop. Please give me a shop. I'm gonna head this way. This is death. I foresee it. This is death. I hope you enjoyed watching because this is the end. A ship with pirate markings demand your surrender. Uh, these are sad times uh, when even Zoltan space is beset by pirates. You doubt these fools will be missed. Um, okay. I do not have time for this. So I'm going to go ahead and... Oh my god. We're dead. We're dead. No, this is it. This is game over. We're dead. I'm going to... Oh my gosh. Wait, can they even get through our shields? I don't know that they can. Okay, never mind. Uh, shoot them in the shields, apparently. I think I think we're actually going to be okay, to be honest with you. Is he... Is that thing stopping this from... Is he honestly shooting lasers out of the air or what? He just destroyed this combat drone. Or this combat drone got blown up by that thing. What is going on? This is going to be the slowest fight in the history of fights. I have to hit their shields at least, like, one time, you know? We can jump away. I don't want to jump away. We can kill these guys. They keep shocking this thing. He blocks the first one and then the next two hit. We need this to be working. Like this right here. He's going to shoot again. Right when those shoot. Yes! Okay, we've hit them. Now we need that to happen, and then we need to shoot again. No, they fixed it. Okay, so this is like the longest, the longest battle of all time. What, what can I do? Quick, think of something. Think of something. Get another combat drone up. How many combat drones are we going to throw out here? That's my question. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, okay. They just got slammed by that. Um, let's shoot them in the oxygen. Actually, let's shoot them in the drone control, because I'm tired of this thing blocking all my bullets. Okay. Alright, you win. Here's some equipment from our stores. Leave us alone. Um. We're not going to accept surrender this time, bud. Not today. You came at me. Now I come back at you. You came at me, and now you die. Would you get shot in the shields? We could have came to this peacefully. You saw I was low health. You thought you could kill me. And now you die. Now you're the one with low health. And I'm the one with more health than you were. You had before. Dummy. If you surrender again, I will accept. I promise. <laughs> if you surrender... Just again, I will honestly take it. Uh, I could have ended the fight. Yes, but that is... You're dead. And I win. Because I'm the beast, and I destroy all. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And there's a store. And I... Okay. Uh... Mantis crew here uh, has hunkered down in the abdomen of a long-dead space whale. The only way, presumably, uh, for them to operate their black market trade without detection. Worth a look? Uh, yeah, I would very much enjoy. Uh, repairs are hauled every time you collect scrap. The rooster is scrap uh, collected by 15%. Weapon pre-igniter is boss. Long-range scanners is boss. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and upgrade as much as possible. Uh, just purely for the sake of not dying. Because I would very much enjoy being alive longer uh, and now we will continue on into the into the depths of space you uh, 
arrive at a Zoldan research facility. They say they are researching genetic distortion due to stasis sleep and prolonged FTL travel. They ask if your crew has time to undergo, undergo a few scans. Yeah, I'll participate in your study. Your crew calmly lines up for the Zoltans to take their readings. After a short time, the process is done. They contact you. Thank you for your participation in our study. Please accept these small cakes made from stiff dough as well as some scrap. 14 scrap. Thank you very much, kind sir. We're gonna head to the distress beacon because what, what, what? Distress beacon! Distress beacon! Okay. Uh, you find the source of the distress call. A small reacher's. Okay, let's remember English language. Uh, a small research station. Uh, it appears a small laboratory fire got out of control and is threatening to destroy the station. Uh, their fire suppression system is not responding. Send your crew in a shuttle to help put out the fire. Try to dock. Okay, dock and try to rescue the survivors. We have no rock crew members. And rock crew members take no fire damage. I believe one of us would die. Um, dock and try to rescue the survivors. We're going to dock and try to rescue the survivors. Come on! You uh, locate the highest concentration of life forms and bring the ship alongside the station. Before you can begin to offload the survivors, a huge blast splits the station apart. Your ship is thrown away and some debris pierces your hull. You watch helplessly as the last of the survivors are consumed in the collapse of the station. Uh, we have 18 scrap and 4 damage to your hull. It doesn't explain where we got the scrap from, uh, but... Cortana will now go and fix those sensors because I believe that that's what got damage, damaged in that explosion. Didn't mean to open the door at all. We're going to go ahead and jump to the distress and then the store. Distress beacons always have a chance for scrap. Uh, you have encountered a refugee ship drifting in space. It looks as if it was fleeing the rebel advance and ran out of fuel. It's just just beacon is active, but you're not sure anyone is on board. Hail them. As you hail the refugee ship, a Zoltan ship suddenly jumps into the system. Uh, it claims the refugees are criminals and accuses you of escorting fugitives. Before you can respond, it cuts communication and power up to weapon. We had this one last episode, I believe. Uh, we're gonna hull laser them in the hull, and then we're gonna combat drone them in the combat and destroy them, hopefully, and not miss our first bullet. Just very reminiscent of uh, you little combat drone uh, when you first started this wonderful run. Uh, you missed your first ever shot, and it was very embarrassing for you, and I do feel bad. But, like, you know, whatever. Okay, here we go. Oh, my gosh. It really just comes down to blind luck, you know? How did, wait, how did the bullet get through there? I'm not sure. Oh, maybe their second shields weren't up and the combat drone shot through. Come on! One, it breaks the first shield, then misses, then breaks the second shield. If it breaks both shields, it can just hit the shield. Oh, okay. Well, oh, they've been hit. Now we're doing damage. We're starting to destroy. Hit him in the, I don't know. That. Yep. There you go. Hit him in the oxygen. Do it, do it, do it. Yeah, there we go. Boom. You exploded. The Zoltan ship breaks apart, and you salvage what you can. Uh, one fuel, one missile, 33 scrap. Contact the refugee ship. Uh, the refugee ship thanks you for your assistance. As a gesture of goodwill, and seeing how effectively you dispatch the enemy ship, they offer up what supplies they can spare. Uh, I'm not going to read to you what supplies it was, because it was a lot. And now we have 84 scrap, which is great. Uh, a human ship hails. My friends, please, there is nothing I, I don't have. And there is nothing worth waiting that I can't get. Why not take a look around my shop? Okay, I will. How about, guy, if you stop talking. Mind, mind control, crew teleporter, cloaking, defense drone. Uh, it fires faster than Mark 1. It can also shoot down incoming lasers. Page 2. Elizabeth! Uh, Gumpo and Neelis. Neelis. Zoltan Shield Bypass. Allows crew bomb teleportation and mind control to work through ship procedures. Uh, scrap a career. Allows the ship to collect 10% more scrap from any source. Emergency respirators. Crew take half damage from low oxygen. Um, we're going to take the scrap recovery arm. Heal all the way up. Go back to page one and look again. Nah, there's nothing really worthwhile. We can do one of these. And two fuel. Awesome. We came out of that one on top, didn't we? Um, 
Looks like we're just gonna have to head to the exit, apparently. Gonna have to cut this one short, because I don't think that we can actually jump away from it. Uh, something strikes you odd about a moon in the distance. That's no moon. It's a space station. Check it out. A closer inspection reveals signs of habitation on the surface, but nothing else particularly interesting. Oh, okay. Well, why did you, why did you, why did you get me all psyched for it being the Death Star and then don't even... <laughs> what up with that, game? That's mean. Oh, wow. Okay. The Mantis outcasts sometimes make the mistake of taking the Zoltan for easy game. Um, a scout moves in to attack while a boarding party beams aboard from a nearby transport. Intruders on board. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and suffocate them. Take damage. Take damage. Enjoy the damage. What is... How did he get in here? Why is he in here? Oh my gosh, Siri, get out of there! Run away. Run away! We're not even firing. Forgot that there was a battle taking place. Please die. Martin, help! Get in there! Take out your own people! Take them out! We must... Get oxygen back into here. Uh, open all doors. Heal, heal, heal. Martin, get out of there. Siri, we need you, actually. Quickly, Siri, get healed up. I found three hospitals in your area. Siri, shut up. <laughs> okay, don't worry about these guys, guys. Guys, girls, guys. Uh, we're going to take them out. It's it's simple. Martin, put out the, put out the flames, man. Just put out the fires. And that's it. And that marks their fate. There we go. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Okay, here we go. Boom, that's what I'm talking about. Martin, I don't know if you've ever put out a fire before, but it involves hurrying up and putting the fire out. And Katana is going to come in and help you, apparently, because you can't put out a fire by yourself. Please put out the fire and then fix that. Maybe we can get his uh, repairing up more. Actually, Katana apparently was the one who finished repairing that, not Martin. So Martin will stay at the same lousy repair speed, I guess. Alrighty, Katana can get back in there, and then we can close these doors. Martin will just heal up over time. Um, I'm going to risk it. I'm going to head up here see what is going on um you see a small station fitted with hundreds of repair drones you receive an automated message we don't know who you are and we don't care but this is the right place for some ship repair i'm gonna ignore you please because of that advertisement specifically okay gonna head down here Boop, and there should be nothing yeah okay head to the exit Perfect. You arrive at a long-range beacon when the FTL drive is charged. You can jump to the next sector. Uh, you stumble across a rebel ship distributing supplies to local civilian colonies. It's probably not anything military-grade, but every little bit helps. Uh, a rebel ship distributing supplies to local civilians. Wait and steal the supplies from the civilians. Oh my gosh! Attack the rebels or leave them beat. Rebels are the bad guys, right? Yeah, we're the Federation. Oh, but I like supplies. I need to ask myself, are we prepared to do everything necessary? I embrace the dark side. I'm gonna wait and steal the supplies from the civilians. A col the colonists hand over the supplies and you load it onto your ship. As you jump away, you crack it open to discover nothing more than vaccinations for a local plague. I'm a bad person. Well, Hey, what are you going to do when you're a bad guy? Bad guys be bad guys be bad guys, right? Here we go. Uh, you discover a number of Zoltan civilian ships fighting off pirates. Unfortunately, one ship mistakes you, mistakes your purpose and moves into attack. They're refusing all communication. You have no choice but to fight. See, this is why civilians need to get out of the way. You decide to fight me? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Um, nervous, nervous. That's what took us out last time. <gasps> Go, okay. Oh, we're okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, I cringed visibly. And I don't do a face cam, so, you, you know, you wouldn't see that I cringed. 
I think my face game would go down here if it were anywhere. Okay. Oh, we just got, we just took like one hull damage. Take him out. Wrecked, 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 wrecked. Get owned, kid. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, whole laser, whole laser. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. If we could have a weapon pre-igniter, that'd be amazing. But it's so much money. Okay, there we go. We take out their thing that I don't like. Yep. Take out their engines or whatnot. So that they stop dodging. Come on, come on, come on. Shoot it! Yes. They're getting shields back up for some reason. They're getting weapons back up. Hit them in the weapons. I don't know what's more important to focus down, weapons or shields, that's the issue that I have. Well, apparently weapons, because that kills them instantly. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Let's continue. That's it. That's all we wanted. Okay, let's get to the exit right now, ASAP. We literally stayed for as long as humanly possible. We will now jump to the next sector, which will be rock-controlled or civilian... Um, let's not go to the hostile sectors until we have to back here. Um, that's it, guys. I kind of embraced the dark side there for a second. Thought we'd be making some sick gains, but we actually just stole vaccines for a plague, um, that was on that planet. Um, but hey, if we had a Death Star, we'd just blow up the planet anyway, so whatever. Um, Honestly, I think that the Federation's the bad guys in this game. You know, the Rebels are just trying to... Like, they were delivering vaccines to a planet. You know? The Rebels don't seem like too bad of people. I think the Federation are the bad guys. I think we're playing as bad guys. Next next ship, I'm going full bad guy mode. I'm blowing up everybody. No surrender. Uh, we don't take prisoners. I will blow up slavers with slaves still on them because I do not care... Uh, no, I'm not going to do that, but that would be fun. I'm probably going to do it. Okay, uh, so yeah, okay, that's it. Uh, my name is Bryce. This was Shield of Respect. I guess I can't be a bad guy if my name is Shield of Respect. Ooh, okay, well, I will respectfully end your lives. How about that? Okay, that sounds great. Perfect. All right, let me know what you guys thought. Uh, I'm pretty sure uh, Anne Hathaway, Cortana, Siri, Martin, and Roper would very much appreciate it if you left a like on this video. And I will see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Tell me how I'm doing. Tell me if I want to be on the next ship. Tell me what the next ship name should be. I don't care. Tell me anything. Tell me about your day. I don't care. I'll see you. I, I do care about your day. I mean, I don't care what you ask me. I'll answer any question. Okay. All right. Love you. Bye.